Um, and my role is the project coordinator for the Start to Success project. My name's Kerry Summerfield. I'm uh, Deb Bowie. Today um, we're in the student hub uh, in the Science Centre and we have launched the project. We help to coordinate the whole project so there's lots of different strands to it and we have eight in total. Um, so our job is to coordinate all of those strands to make sure everything's running okay um, and we're evaluating and making sure it's relevant to the students. We've got changes, brighter futures, healthy minds and someone representing the access team. So these are all services that work very closely with the university. We sent out a student survey to all students at Staffs, Keele and the three surrounding colleges, so the sixth form, uh, Stoke College and Newcastle College. Over 2,000 students completed the survey, so we have some really rich data now that we can now use um, to work out where the pinch points are for students and what actually we need to focus on. Looking at what um, students think are barriers to them accessing support. We're asking students to let us know what stops them from talking about mental health and what the university can do to encourage those conversations. We want students to co-create what we're doing so it's suitable for them. It will influence the work that we're doing um, on the interventions that are needed. We're also looking at particular student groups who might have different needs than others. We're looking at what they are and what we can do as a university to break those barriers down. I'm working on uh, pathways into and out of external services for students when they're actually experiencing some mental health difficulties. I've been creating student journey maps uh, to map the experience from when a student applies to university right the way through to graduation and identifying any pressure points along the way where a student might need extra help uh, and interventions to support their mental health and well-being. Um, so we're looking at improving the pathways that are already existing, maybe changing some of the pathways, changing how students are referred, looking at a more timely response, making them more accessible to students. We've also um, developed some training for staff. Um, so staff will have um, a package that is delivered by MIND, the charity. So yeah, the training will include things um, such as boundaries, so how do we ensure that staff um, can maintain boundaries when helping and support a student. It will also look at how they can then look after themselves after they've dealt with a difficult situation uh, or a difficult conversation. It will do general mental health awareness, looking into different conditions, um, and then actually really structured how to have a conversation with a student so staff can feel more confident when going out and speaking to students. 